So my name is Callie Ellis. I live in San Juan Capistrano right now, and I'm gonna have the gastric sleeve. Um, my family asked why haven't I done this before. I talked to my twin last night, and I told her about it, and she goes, what took you so long? I've been telling you about this forever, to do something extra, because she's like, you're working so hard and nothing's working. So I was like, I know, it was just me procrastinating. My mom, since she knows I don't do doctors, she goes, are you sure? Yes, this is what I want. I don't even go to the doctor, really. When I do, it's someone's dragging me there for something. So I'm nervous, yes, but then I'm excited because I know what the end result's gonna be. And I know I'm gonna kick myself. Why didn't I do this before? Why did I wait so long to do this? My friends and family are very supportive. Very. Even my work is. My supervisor actually is doing the same thing and she recommended me. She told me that there was this great doctor she found, so I did a bunch of research on him and um, decided to go with him. But Dr. Faith came in and told us, you know, right away, you know, I went to school here. This is my specialty. Um, like some of the other doctors will come in later on and do weight loss because this is where I've started. I haven't, you know, detoured or anything. This is where I've started and this is where I've kept going. He does stuff with Cedar sinai and everyone knows that's a huge thing out here, you know. So that kind of was like, oh, okay. That kind of pushed it even a little bit more that he knows what he's doing and he's, you know, he's like, if you have any questions, you can just call me and ask. He's actually taking the time and caring about you as an individual. And um, we started talking and Dr. Faith has a great personality. Makes you feel like he's basically just talking to you, but yet there's a bunch of people in there. He was like, well, let me stop and talk with you real fast. Do you have anything that you, know, you want me to answer for you? I wanted to make sure that I could still have kids later because I'm 27 and I come from a big family. I'm one of six kids. Then he's like, you're fine. I've had two patients who um, had kids within a year. And they were totally fine. Unfortunately, my work schedule is, I kind of never know exactly what days I have off, you know, beforehand, really. So um, I went to the Beverly Hills office just because they had an opening. Um, before I even got there, they had already ran my insurance. The day of the consultation, they're like, yes, you're fine. Your insurance covered it. And then these are the next couple things that you have to do. So the nutritionist, um, you have to talk with a psychiatrist. Um, I did mine over the phone, just made it easier because like I said, with work, who knows when I'd get in. So far everything is going according to plan. And hopefully, we're hoping I'll get it done. Hopefully the beginning of next month, I wanna get this going. My highest was 360. I've lost 80 so far, wow. just by myself, in about two years, two and a half years. But I just stopped, that's my problem, is I'll lose it and then I'll just stop. And that's where I'm at right now. You no, know, I've been dieting my whole life. It was just, my sister was getting married. And I got thrown into the maid of honor position, which I was like, oh, I can't look like this anymore. So, when I really got really serious and started doing stuff. Went on a really strict diet, um, and I lost a bunch of weight on that. Then it would be yo-yo, you know, because you can only eat this and this, and you know, I can't eat chicken and vegetables two times a day for the rest of my life, and that's it. I'm hoping with the sleeve that it won't just stop at a certain point and I can keep going. Well, when you're overweight, you see the pictures and you think, how could I let myself get like that? Um, I saw a picture from Christmas and I was like, how, how could I let myself do that? You know, get that big. I didn't even know they took the picture because when you are bigger, you stay behind the camera. You know, you're the one taking the pictures. You don't want to be in front of the camera. You don't want to see, you know, other people like, oh, you're really pretty. And you're like, oh, thank you, you know. And inside you kind of know they're just being nice to you, you know. So I always stay behind the camera, take the pictures and remember it that way versus being in front of the camera so I don't have to look at myself. 
I want to be able to be in front of the camera, take the pictures, you know, make the goofy faces with all of my friends. If we're going to Disney World in September and there's 14 of us going and I'm making someone else take the pictures this time. It's always me who has the camera, who does everything. I'm actually gonna pass it off this time and make someone else take the picture so I can be in the picture. You know, I can, I can remember and look like, hey, this is what I looked like. We went two years ago to Florida, my sister and I, and I have those pictures and I wanna compare them now to afterwards. Like, hey, this is me then and look at me now. I'm looking 10 times better. You know, and I'm actually glad to be in the pictures, not like, okay, quick, snap the picture and let's go, because I look horrible in it, and I know I do. I'm looking forward to be able to, like, go out and go shopping with the girls. Um, not have to go to the plus sizes where, you know, the other girls are just going to the regular sizes. I want to be able to go on a hike and not be, like, out of breath or I'm like the biggest person there. I want to be able to, to go out and go play, play baseball, not just you know sit there and watch it because you can't run when you're so big. I want to be able to get in a seat plane without having to get an extender. You know, it's the little things like that. Before, I couldn't even fit in some of the rides at Disneyland. Now that I've lost the weight, I can, but I want to be able to be like, you know, yeah, I can, there's a ton of room. You can fit an extra person in the seat with me. Those are more my goals. They're not huge, but they're, they're mine, and that's what I want out of it.